quasar tubes. Super popular, really affordable. This methylene clamp costs $45. For that price, I can just get another one of these tubes. So I wanted to see if there was a way cheaper option for mounting these things. And I was able to come up with something DIY that everyone should be able to make at home with not too much cost. This is what we came up with. It's a baby pin floor mount with T12 Kino tube clamp holders. I also took some electrical tape and wrapped it around because the back of these things can scratch pretty easily. For the actual construction, screw some holes into the baby pin at the same width that you will need for the rivets. Take the brackets, put them in, rivet gun. It's genuinely that easy. This took us half an hour. This cost $17 roughly to make with all my supplies, whereas the modern studio version cost $38 plus shipping. The more you make of these, the cheaper it'll get. These Kino tube holders come in a pack of 24, so you can make up to 12 stands with a $10 box of metal. It's much more affordable the more you make. So I'm pretty happy with this as a solution. You can also try epoxy. I just found that I wasn't getting it right and it snapped off the one time I tried it. I trust metal into metal much more than I trust any type of glue. So rivet gun was the way to go for me. Mathelini clamp, $45. DIY Kino tube holder, 17. Pretty easy to save some money here. Quasar tubes are great. I'll continue to use them and now I don't feel so bad about how I'm gonna mount them when I'm not gaffing them like I usually do. But I wanted the proper way to put something into a grip head and this is that solution. Hope this helped anyone else looking for a way to mount these cheaply. White flash out.